I love her. It's gonna make me ball my eyes out. I already know that's what's gonna happen at the. All right, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna be watching The Last of Us episode two. Now the last episode was really good. It was really fun. RP Sarah though, that was really sad actually. But the rest of the episode was pretty damn fun. So I'm excited to see what happens next. You know, it ended with, with Tess and Joel find, finding out about Ellie. The soldier tested them and everything, and they saw. They saw the wound on her arm, but she's not she's not turning for whatever reason. I, also, I kept calling it a virus. It's not a virus. It's a fungus. I am sorry. If I call it a virus, I am sorry. But also, I was also wrong about going to the north because it's a it's a fungus and it can survive in the cold. It can't survive in the heat. So you got to go south. And that's what Joel said to do. Like go to Mexico or something like before, you know, the 20 year jump happened so whatever but but yeah i'm gonna stop wasting time we're just gonna hop right into this episode if you'd like to watch the full length reaction that will be available on patreon so let's get started jakarta indonesia september 24th 2003 okay so we're going back and this is what the radio is talking about right because joel was like jakarta isn't that whatever and then sarah corrected him on where it was okay. indonesia yeah, they, they need her help. <laughs> yeah, they realize this is when they're realizing some serious shit just happened, and they're like, okay, we need her. Yeah. But why did you use chlorazol to prepare the slide? We use it as a preparation for the body of the body of the body of the I guess it can. <laughs> we were wrong. <laughs> No, I am not okay. I'm not a specialist, but I don't think that's what it's supposed to look like when you cut through the skin. Ugh. Oh, that's what it is. Ew. Um, it's smart by her to just get the hell out of there. Smart. Seorang perempuan yang tiba-tiba melakukan kekerasan menyerang. Mereka kemudian mengunci perempuan itu di kamar mandi sampai kemudian perempuan itu mencoba menyerang dan terpaksa harus ditembak. Karena dengan orang yang digigitnya. Sayangnya beberapa jam kemudian telah menjadi keharusan sesuai dengan prosedur. Mereka harus tetap di aspek. To execute them. Oh my god. I mean, siapa yang menggigit perempuan itu, Pak? Kami tidak tahu, Ibu. Jadi artinya mereka masih bersekutu. Yep. Lalu pekerja yang lain bagaimana? 14 orang hilang. 14. Oh, that's great. Yeah, she knows. Kami membawa Ibu Ratna kemari Dragi. untuk membantu kami untuk mencegah penyebaran. Saya telah menghabiskan waktu hidup saya untuk mempelajari hal. Jadi tolong dengarkan so, saya. Listen carefully. <laughs> okay, there is no vaccine possible. There is no medicine yet. Dan tidak ada vaksin. Jadi apa yang harus kami lakukan? What do we do? We pray. Bomb. Bomb. Oh. Bomb seluruh kota. Bomb this. You just nuke the city. No. Mm -hmm. And everyone in it. Yeah, dude. I, I would not be able to make that call. Like, whoever's decision it is, you know, whoever's final decision, I, no chance. If it's me, no chance I'm making that decision. Damn. Yeah, I don't know. There's no chance I'm gonna be able to make that decision to nuke the city. There's no way. Like, I get it, you're doing it to keep it from spreading, but like, it's a moral dilemma. Like, it's easy to say, oh yeah, we'll just nuke it, yeah, no problem. But then like actually making that decision to do it and then doing it, that's that's a completely different thing. That's completely different. So, uh, but I'm assuming they ended up not nuking the city. <laughs> Morning. Now they've just been watching her. Because in their head, she can turn at any given moment. Do I look like I'm infected? Show us your arm. Getting any worse, is it? If we're out in the open city, why aren't we getting swarmed? Don't worry about that. Well, I'm gonna. What was Marlene doing with an infected kid? I'm not infected. Locked me up and had her guys test me every day to see if I was getting sick. Test you how? I have to pee. Test you how? Maybe how the time? The tenant hold out my hand and then keep it steady. But you know, I think what really impressed them was the fact that I didn't turn into a fucking monster. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There's not gonna be anything bad in here? Just you. Oh, 
she made it through the fucking night, Joe. It doesn't matter. It's gonna happen sooner or later. All right, we're still close to the wall. We sneak her back into the QZ. We find a different way to get the battery. This is our best shot. Have to risk it. You need to stop talking about this kid like she's got some kind of life in front of her. Oof. I mean, he's gonna do a total 180 on the way he feels about her eventually. Like, it's gonna happen slowly. It's not gonna be fast. It's gonna slowly happen. Why are you so important to Marlene? What? Don't lie to me. Oh, geez. I, I've been... I should be infected, but I'm not. So there's obviously something that I haven't turned in the timeline that I'm supposed to be turned in. So obviously there's a delay for some reason. There's a Firefly base camp somewhere out west with doctors. They're working on a cure. Mm -hmm. I've heard this before. Mm -hmm. and, what and they need her. The key to finding the vaccine. That's what this is. Oh, he's heard this. Is Times, vaccines, miracle cures. No. Yeah, but this time it's real with her because she hasn't turned. We need both. This isn't gonna end well, Tess. We need to go back. I mean, so then, has there been other people who haven't turned, like, right away, like, in the timeline they're supposed to, but then eventually they do? Like, is it delayed for them or something? Like, she's not the only one? What the Fireflies say, if they believe that she is, we get what we want. If she so much as twitches. <laughs> I love her. Can I have a gun? Absolutely. No. Yay, Jesus, fine. I have to throw a fucking sandwich at them. <laughs> Damn. Watch. She's gonna turn at the very end of the entire series. Like, at the very end, she, that's when it's finally gonna get her. And she's gonna turn to one of them, and then Joel's gonna have to be the one to kill her after he's already developed this incredible bond with her, with her like he had with Sarah. And it's... It's gonna make me fucking ball my eyes out. I already know that's what's gonna happen at the very end. And no, I haven't played the game, but that's just my prediction for what's gonna happen. They hit most of the big cities like this. They had to slow the spread somehow. Damn. It worked here, but it didn't in most places. Okay, so they actually did bomb. Okay. I guess not nude, but like just smaller, but other bombs. Okay. Well, dude, if you're gonna bomb a city, you might as well nuke it. Go big or go home, you know? Make sure the job is done. <laughs> Where the fuck are they already? I don't know it when they're close. <laughs> are we there yet? <laughs> How did you get bit? This came at me out of nowhere. Thought I got away, but... So it was just you in there alone? Yeah, like, where are your parents? Like, what happened to your parents? How old are you? Like, 14. I mean, I'm guessing her parents are dead. Nobody's gonna be coming after you, right? Like, mom, dad. I'm an orphan, and everyone said the open city was crazy. Like, swarms of infected running around everywhere. Yeah, this is fucking lame. <laughs> We're not being shot at yet. <laughs> uh, ignore. Keep it moving. You gotta keep it moving. You gotta keep it moving. What was that? I don't know. I didn't, I didn't hear anything. Did you hear something? Because I didn't. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Dude, I know we're not swimming across this. I know we're not swimming across this. Wait, are we going in there? Oh. Yeah, we gotta get to the stairwell on the other side. Oh my god. Dude, how do you know there's not like an infected person down there? They're just gonna grab you by your feet. I mean, it's not that deep. It's not that bad. Ding ding! Shut the fuck up. Don't fucking do that. Please. Yes, ma'am. Would you like me to check your luggage? Yes, ma'am. Rob, You're a weird kid. You're a weird kid. <gasps> oh, my. I was about to say, she probably never had a childhood. Because <laughs> she was born after all this shit happened. Walking across that, it's not too... It's not bad, but, like, the worst part about it would, would be having wet socks. All right. Well, I mean, maybe I could climb up there. Or no, so, so, something's bad's gonna happen. Okay, and also, I'm kidding. Like... Walking through that's not that bad. I'm just being a prima donna about it on purpose. You good up there? Yeah. Uh, it's a bit of a mess, so I'm gonna need a few minutes. Perfect. An opportunity for them to bond. Where are you from? Texas. Texas. Was it hard? Like, knowing they were people once? Nah. <laughs> sometimes. Nah, I guess sometimes. Like, the kids, yeah, and the kids won't. The ones that are kids would be hard to kill. Like, they're gonna go through so much shit together and survive- barely survive so much just for her to get infected and die at the end. Okay, I just have to mention that for, like, what I said earlier. Oh my god, that's a lot! 
They're connected. Long fibers like wires, some of them stretching over a mile. Mm. And you step on a patch of cordyceps in one place, and you can wake a dozen infected from somewhere else. Oh, that's great. Yeah, that's definitely gonna happen. <laughs> You're not immune from being ripped apart. You understand? Mm -hmm. You still gotta be smart. You've gotta be fucking kidding me. Oh, yeah, I'm good. What, what, why? Is it dead? It's bone dry. Mm. Could mean they're all finally dead in there. Okay. I have a spare hand. Congratulations. <laughs> yeah, you're not getting it again. I was gonna say, going through the city, you know, with a bunch of like zombies, like infected type, reminds me of Daisy, right? Imagine I said this, this show reminds me of Daisy without knowing The Last of Us was a video game. Imagine that. That'd be so funny. <laughs> like, I had no, I just had no idea about the actual video game. <laughs> but just going through the city with, like, zombies and infected, that's, like, the only thing that ri reminds me about Daisy. Like, that's it. Oh, shit. Ooh, he's not, like, changed. He's not. No, he's dead, but, like, he looks normal. What the fuck he's did that? Are you saying that they did that? No. Well, there's something in this museum because I don't think a person would have done that to him. And they're implying it wasn't infected, so there's something else. <gasps> mm, that's I love that. Do you know how terrifying it would be to wander through a city with infected in it? it like. It seems like in the movies and TV, like in the movies, it doesn't seem that bad. But like, dude, I bet it's freaking terrifying. Like just playing Daisy makes me like nervous, you know, like when you're playing Daisy and then you just see it like, oh, oh, when you just see a bunch of them and they come after you, that's that's terrifying. And just in Daisy can imagine in real life. But then again, in Daisy, you run slow as fuck. And the controls are hella laggy, so I can't do much. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, what the... Oh, great, now we're trapped in this room. That's great, dude. That's such a video game thing to happen. <laughs> I feel like I'm going to be saying that a lot, too, about this. About this show. Mmm... They can't see it, but they can hear. Can they smell? <laughs> oh, that is not an infected. Yeah, that's something different. Oh my god. <laughs> Come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. It's gonna be right next to him. Oh, it's right there. Okay, I, I see why they can't see. They got all that shit on their face. Over their eyes. But the fungus, like, grow on top of them or something? Like, on their head? Or... Yeah, there's just gonna be more, like... I'm guessing these ones are harder to kill, too. So, like, a super infected. Oh! Are you kidding me? Hey, let's get the fuck out of here. Yeah, take his mind off of that. I mean, technically, like, nothing should happen to her. I feel like nothing is gonna happen to her. I would assume if it, and it happens again and again and again, it's probably not going to work every single time. That's probably why she ends up dying by the end of the end of the series. What about the kid? You mean the first bite didn't take? But what about the second? I'd like you just take the good yeah. news. Oh, imagine going down a ladder with a hairline fracture in your hand. That'd be so shitty. Yeah, look, he's looking at his hand. Like, I don't know about you guys, but like, I death grip ladders when I go on them. 
Like, if I'm going up more than, like, 10 feet, 20 feet, I'm death gripping them. I had to climb a 40-foot ladder one time, and I, I pissed myself. Not literally, but, like, I, I was shaking so bad. Where the fuck are they? <sighs> Damn, this already 45 minutes have gone by. It's gone by so quick. Joe? What the fuck is going on? I don't know. They went inside. Watch, they're all dead or something. Oh! They're dead, yep. Who killed them? Fedra? No. Oh. Them got bit. The healthy ones fought the sick ones, everyone lost. Tess, it's over. We are going home. This is not my fucking home! Mm. I'm staying. Our luck had to run out sooner or later. I feel like we were never lucky to begin with. <laughs> She's infected. <gasps> what? Show me. Uh, that's why she doesn't want to go back. Uh, okay, I see, I see. Oh my god. So this, okay, that's, that's great. Okay, I'm <laughs> killing you right there. I have to, sorry. Take your bandage off. What, oh, is this her gonna, is hers gonna be way worse now? Yeah, it's the same. This is real. Mm -hmm. Josh is fucking real. I need you to get her to Bill and Frank's. No. They'll take her off mm -hmm. your hands. Yeah. Hand. I, I never mm -hmm. ask you for anything, not to feel the way I felt, mm -hmm. not to you shut the fuck up because I don't have time. You keep her alive, and you said everything right. Aww. All the shit we did. Please say yes, Joel. Please. <sighs> oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh shit! <laughs> yep. Yeah. Oh shit! Oh no! We just alerted it, huh? Now they know where to go. Yep. <gasps> Okay, we got we got all bounce. I, I feel like Tess is gonna stay behind. Joel is not gonna kill her. There's she's just gonna stay behind, and they're all just gonna get her while they while Joel and Ellie get out of here. How many? All of them. Maybe a minute. <laughs> oh wait, I will burn this place down. Hell yeah. Making sure that they don't follow you. Oh, Tess is about to blow herself up. And get all, get most of them, hopefully. You can see. Oh. No! We're not Damn. leaving her! We, we have to, we have to, dog. Oh, that'd be so terrifying for Tess. Dude, you gotta time this so right. Oh, the lighter, come on! <gasps> Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! Oh, they're, okay, they're, they're ignoring her. Come on! <laughs> she's not, she's not gonna be able to do it? Oh, fuck. What if you just, like, hold it down and, like, in the gas or whatever, and then you start sparking it in the gas? Like, with the spark that it's barely giving to it? Like, like, you know? I don't know. Are they about to kiss? Ugh! Ew, what the fuck? It's not like kissing, I think the fungus is going inside of her, but like... Oh. Damn. Honestly, I would rather die in an explosion than just be like torn apart and like eaten by them and everything. That was episode two. All right, this went by really fast. Like, I feel like it's only been like, like it feels like this was only like 20 minutes, like 25 minutes. Like, damn, it's like you know the show's good. <laughs> well, we lost Tess in this episode. I really liked her though. She was a strong character, but she got bit. Okay, that's why she didn't want to go back. She only had a certain amount of time left and everything, and she wanted to make sure Joel could get. Ellie to them and everything, so I like her. She 
She believes in Ellie. She believes in. And like Joel made an interesting comment. Like he's heard this before. So like, have people claimed this before? And like, were they valid? I mean, I'm guessing they weren't valid. I'm guessing they turned anyway, because, you know, they might have gotten banned. They're like, wait, no, blah blah, and then they turned eventually or whatever. Maybe it was delayed for them or something. I don't know. Or they were just capping to buy themselves time. So like whoever they were with didn't just kill them on site. Hopefully it works out for Ellie, but I feel like, yeah, Joel made a good point. Like he, she can't just keep getting bit and then like nothing happening. It's going to get her eventually. Like there's only so much she can take, I guess, you know, like it has to. And that's how I see the end of playing out. Now it's just going to be Joel and Ellie together for a little bit. So their bond's obviously going to grow and stuff. And then he, she's going to remind him of Sarah and then he's going to become attached to her. And then she's, and then at the very, very end, she's going to die. Like, I don't know how long this series is supposed to be. I, per, I'm guessing it's more than one season. So I don't know how many seasons, but like, I'm guessing the very last season is when it happens. So like, but yeah, we also got introduced to a new form of the infected. I'm not sure what they're called or anything, but, but it looked like the fungus was growing on their head. So that's why they can't see, but they look, they look like super infected, you know, like they're a level up. They seem like they're a little bit harder to kill. So that's, that's great. I love that. But, but honestly, that, I think that was a good way for Tess to go because like if Joel had to kill her, dude, that'd be so shitty. I don't know if he'd be able to, well, no, honestly, Joel would probably be able to kill her. Like, he seems, like, he wanted to kill Ellie immediately. But, obviously, he doesn't know Ellie like that or anything. And, like, he's obviously known Tess for a bit now. And, you know, he has some attachment to her. So, I, I think he would have killed her, you know, if it came down to it. Because it's, like, obviously, they know she's a bit. They're not going to just, like, wait for her to turn then kill her. Like, you can't, that's literally what happened to the people in this building right before we got here, you know? So, if, like, let's say he, like, let's say he didn't shoot that one on the ground and the fungus wasn't, like, tripped, and the fungus wasn't activated, I'm guessing she would have just had, she would have just been like, alright, just shoot me, or she'll just, you know, shoot herself or something like that. Dying in that explosion, I, I would much rather have that happen. That was, that, that, that kiss was a little awkward at the end right there, but it was, like, putting the fungus out of that infected's mouth into hers. And then she dropped the lighter, and then boom. Not not a not the worst way to go, in my opinion. Not the worst way. But yeah, that was episode two of The Last of Us. Comment down below what you thought about this episode down below in the comments. And if you liked the video, like the video. And thanks for watching.